Hi everybody, it is Angie, Treasured Vintage. I am going to finish off one box of bracelets and I am going to move on to brooches today and uh, we'll get into the bracelets, more bracelets, uh, another video. But I do have some to finish from the last box we were in. I thought I had finished it, but I didn't. So let's see what's left in that box. This very, very pretty rhinestone one. Um, I feel like it should be signed, and it is. What is it signed? BSK. It feels like it feels like they're acrylic stones. I'm not sure, they don't feel cold. But nonetheless, really pretty. So there's that bracelet. No missing stones, really nice gold tone on it. You have this that kind of reminds me of a, a man's bracelet. Um, has a bear on it. Kind of a... Uh, western maybe and it's flexible i don't know if it might be stainless steel or something i don't know it's got a magnetic clasp and uh, leather straps but it just puts me in the mind maybe of a men's a men's bracelet there's a little i don't know is that lamp work I'm not sure some kind of bead with wires neck uh, bracelet someone made got a lobster claw clasp on it does have some slack in it in the stretch but they're pretty beads I think they might might be vintage I don't know There's a note on this, Casa de Oro, stainless steel. Okay, this is stainless steel bracelet, one of those Italian kind. And it's got some gold and silver links on it. Right there, as an accent. And this is just a silver tone link bracelet unmarked nice one that's pretty I didn't have very many things in the box left but just a few just a few random bracelets to show out of there Cute, stretchy with faux stones in it. Seems like it has all its stretch still left. Another little um, charm bracelet. It's got a nice, nice chain on it with textured findings, toggle clasp, and what kind of charms do we have? Oh, we have little, we have a little pitcher and a little purse and another little purse. Kind of cute, colorful charms. I like the chain. And we just have this pretty, really pretty gold tone. Stretchy with a pink, purple ABs. This one says the Philippines. Philippines. And it's just one of those ones you pull shut. It's kind of cute. And then I have a bunch of just um, chain bracelets. It's 
So this one has hearts on it. And this one's just a serpentine. This one is a cable link. And a... I don't know what kind of a chain that is, but that's interesting. That's a pretty cool chain. And a real small, thin one. I think it's a box chain. A little box chain. They would be cute to wear together. So there's all of those chain bracelets. And that is the bracelet box. Now we're done with that. Sorry for the jiggling there. Put that to the side and look what we have here. Now these are the colorful, mostly colorful enamel brooches that I have. So we'll go through those because I think they're the most interesting rather than just gold tone or silver tone, right? So we have these guys and there's, there's a good many real vintagey ones in here. So aren't they cute? Oops. My goodness. Pretty cute, huh? <laughs> so I don't know what, if the colors represent a country or anything. They're definitely vintage. This one does not, I, th I was thinking they were together, but I don't think they are now. This one's probably a... Uh, what do you think? A Mexico or something? So that looks kind of like a sombrero. This one is... Not. <laughs> anyway, they're little people. There's another... Oh, these, these are scatter pins. These go together. The little girls. I guess they're girls. That little dresses on unless they're kilts i'm gonna say dresses that's what i'm gonna say got a little bear it's got a kind of a an enamel clear coating over it it's a little koala bear Oh, there's this guy, a little elephant with glasses. I've seen this before. I'm not sure if it's Avon, but I've seen that before. Let's see if it's signed. Well, I don't see any signature, but I, ha I have seen that before. That could be a uh, political pin. I could sell that. My political party. Here is, well, if I can get it out, a very cute little tiny cameo pin. A black resin lady on it. It's real small, petite pin. And for the wearing of the green, we have this pretty shamrock. We have one of these type pins. Like, I'm not sure what you call these swag maybe I don't know but anyway like that turtle pretty with that metallic blue and green really bright color quintessential 80s with the jewel tone colors and just a little wooden cheap butterfly
coming up are some birds. Birds. Really cute mallard enamel. M A F C O, maybe? I think M A F C O. There's a cute red, white, and blue patriotic eagle. Can't figure this part out. Can't figure that out. Hmm. I don't know. Oh, okay. I guess this is the beak. The gold part right here is the beak. I guess. Anyway, that seems fairly old. Has one of these. Pinbacks. Here's another bird pin. And here is a pheasant. Here's a painter's palette. Dual finish with some um, splotches of paint on it. No maker's mark. Pretty cute. Something makes me think that's Avon. But I don't see a mark on it. And a ribbed heart pin. Oh, one of my favorites. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> but this is uh, the red hat jewelry. This is a cute design, I have to say. She's got a little necklace on, a little earring, and this little open silhouette. I don't see a signature. Pretty cute, though, for that kind of jewelry. It's a little very silvery looking dogwood. Has some finished uh, loss on the enamel, unfortunately. It's really pretty, though. There's the back. It does have some C-E-R-R. C-E-R-R I I-O. I don't know. It's got, a, it's got a mark on it. And then date 1985, perhaps. Sorello, 1985. Cute little pots with little flowers in them. That's pretty cute. I could see that on a jean jacket. And a little dangling charm and a cheaply done silver tone butterfly unicorn turquoise chips faux I guess oh more birds 
little mallards. Face. Little face pin. P and a something. P and a something and it's 19, what, 95 or something like that. Can't really read it. 19, or is that 89? Yep. And a bird, it's like the, a dove. A dove with rhinestones around it. Big fish pen, which is pretty nice. I think this one is signed, if I remember correctly. I think it's Ivana. Yeah. Ivana. It's a more modern pen. up on some more oldies. These are little scatter pins again. Mother Pearl Bunny Rabbits. Little Broom People. <laughs> little Broom People. Here's the, she looks like a Dutch lady. And does she go with anything else I have? I guess not. I guess I was thinking of, of the colors on, on there. They do go together, I guess. Something about the way this skirt is and the way this skirt is. It's kind of, uh, I feel like it goes together. She's, uh, she's articulated. She's pretty cute. The Bee Gees. Plastic. Plastic pin. And a clock that says Bermuda on it. Couple artisan made pins. We have a star, pearl, and a rhinestone. And we have a heart with a hand. It's like my hand. Take my hand and I'll take your heart. <laughs> I don't know. Hold my hand and I'll I'll be your heart. I'll be in your heart. I don't know. Help me out. <laughs> hearts and hands. Hands and hearts and stars. It's all there. Yep. Yellow flower. Blue hat. Pink flowers. Yellow flower. Ribbon. That's pretty cute, isn't it? That's cute. Looks like it says BJ on it. Believe. Another thing I would could see on a jean jacket. I don't know why. I don't know why I have a certain thing that I would 
imagine things being on a jean jacket. I don't know. This one's cool. Flat black enamel with gold accent, eagle. Pretty gold and silver tin pin. Small. This one's cute. Cream and black enamel, kind of spectator like. A Weight Watchers pin. And this one. Pretty cool. Got little dangling cylinders. It's lucite. It has a, a rhinestone in it. And it is a little pin. And it's a uh, coral, I believe. Hmm, I'm not sure. Not sure what that is. is that coral or maybe not. Have to look at that a little closer. picking up stuff off of this scarf. Every time I pick something up, I pick up the scarf with it with my nails. <laughs> More little figurals. Oh, I think this is Sarah Coventry, and I think it's really pretty old. I'm not sure. I know I have a, a, a pendant necklace like this very similar so I'm not sure it's not marked though then we have these guys mother of pearl with some paint little umbrellas scatter pins parrot red rhinestone eye cute little oh it's cute cute little mushroom with a cute little person underneath reading a paper look at that it's a little i don't know a little munchkin little elf what is it somebody reading a tiny little paper sitting underneath there and we have a an airplane, metal, and enamel. Not signed. And we have a J O V O N pin, which is a sombrero. Um, guy with huge feet and a huge hat, and a mustache, and what is that? Not sure what that is. Anyway, yeah. There's that. J O V O N. I don't think I've ever heard of that. This is very cute, though. I'm really liking that. Got some more birds. Tiny little blue enamel bird. Little birds on a branch. 
Very cute. Looks like they have beads in their eyes. I'm not sure if that one's missing there, it looks like. Really a sweet, sweet little pin. Uh, another parrot. One like this. Another runner. This one I like. This one I like the texture of it. Silver and gold with lots of texture. And this one seems to be, I don't know, pretty old to me. Just blue tin, I guess. Painted. I should just sell these in a lot. And I don't know why I don't do that. I really don't. Let's go to some dogs. I have some dogs. And some other little things. Oh, cute. Gold one. There's a horse. Pretty one. Oh, spotted dog. Race horse. Another one of the spotted, well not spotted, another one of the poodle dogs that were at the beginning, so they're probably little scatter pins. Like they go together. There's another one. And that's cute. Look at the little deer. Blue eye, red nose, brown enamel body. Very cute. And that's cute too. I think I remember um Roberta giving me some of these um, dog pins, and I don't know. It's probably some of these gold ones here that she gave me. Also in there, well, I don't know why it was in there, but a treble clef. Think more birds. Oh, cute. That's cute. Here we have one with feathers. Is that a toucan? Or a parrot? I don't know. This is interesting. I kind of like it. Um, seagull maybe is it, is it like flying into a cloud or flying I would put it like that I'm not sure but I like that I think that's the colors are pretty and uh, the designs pretty on it Here we have an owl I don't know what this is that resin I'm not sure it's green red eyes and an enamel parrot and another tin Japan marked little pin I don't know if it looks like his feet are missing cute though I picked him up at Hope I didn't pay for him. Oh, no feet. A no feet bird. Where are you going, Desi? Little fish. Very cute little stick pins. Oh, not stick pins. Scatter pins. 
that are little fish. And this is a pretty bird. It does have a stone eye. You can't see it very well. It's red. Red stone eye. And uh, no other stones in it. It's kind of strange looking though. The way it's made. Tiny little beetle bug pin. This looks like a cat. Yep. Cat pin. a big old stuffed bird. Definitely old. And we have the ubiquitous roses. Who doesn't have the roses? pin. This one's pretty. Never seen one like that. Rose pin. I'll take you out in a minute, okay? Do you have to go out? Okay, hold on. Uh, rose pin. Rose pin. These two look the same. Okay, Desi. Hold on. Hold on, okay? Go out in a minute, okay? Okay. Little girl's getting impatient. And another rose pin. And guess what we have here? Oh, red hat charm holder. Who doesn't need a red hat charm holder? I don't. <laughs> see. I think I'm almost done with this box. Of course, I thought I was done with the bracelet box and I was not done, but I do think I'm done. Um, a little ladybug, a little yellow beetle, looks like a sugared finish, pretty old one, a K, very pretty K. Very pretty A. A swirly S. Another pretty K. Pretty L. A J. I guess that's a J. I don't think it's a T. And we have a pretty little angel pin. Let me take a quick look. Ah, uh, I think that's it. I'm really going to say that's it. So, thank you for watching. And um, next time, maybe we'll do some more bracelets and mix a couple brooches in. So, thanks a lot. I'm going to take my little girl out and... Uh, Enjoy your Sunday. Have a very blessed day. And we will see you next time. Be kind when you're picking. Bye for now.